Oops, nope, do it. How's everyone going? How's everyone doing, I mean? Something in the way. Still miss the old location. Don't think I ever won't. It's the therapy episode. Ba -da -ba -da -ba 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 -ba. God damn it. Oops. What the fuck? Okay, well, she liked it, but she didn't respond. That was by Riley, right? Yeah, that's by Riley. What the fuck? I guess she's like bringing up her current schedule. I'm just gonna make sure. I know it. Hello? Testing. One. One, two, three. Let's go. Let's go, Levine bros. We are so back. <laughs> How do I live? Mm. 
Nah, if only she would read her DMs. Yo, 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 yo. What's up? How you doing? Great. Travis is doing horrible, but I'm doing great. I'm just going to hide in my truck for a second and go to the bathroom. That's neat, Lachlan. What the fuck? Was I muted that entire time? When the fuck did I mute? Okay, I'm going to the bathroom. I'll be right back. Who are you going to disappear with that truck? I don't know. I'm just hiding in there so I can go to the bathroom. Fuck, this chair's loud. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, I know. I had my headphones on. It's crazy because none of them were a response at all. It was just people chatting on fucking Twitter. I'm going to murder someone. Okay. According to OBS, we're still using my good microphone. You piece of shit. No. Hello. One, two, three. Okay. Wireless headphones, damn the luxury. Yeah. They're really nice. What the fuck? It's 
stay, you piece of shit. Did it stay? Okay. Okay. We're good. Uh. I'm being ghosted by my therapist. I can't believe this. Hello? My therapist is not only ghosting me in my texts, but fucking uh, liking my tweets and replying to them. Holy fuck! Imagine being that slow. LMAO. Relatable. Jump to his current location and disappear him. I haven't even done a session yet. I haven't even met this person. I mean, I have, but like not formally. I met her at Mexico. My heart is going to burst. Alone at a table for two, and I just want to be served. Do I have that in here? No, I don't. Fuck! I'm gonna go make wine shirtless. That's how real men cope with their problems. Get a gun and pew pew. I have guns. I don't have any ammo for them right now. Because all the ammo is in a different car. So I didn't think I'd need a gun for a therapy session. Oh shit. Oh shit! I'm in the hills now, bitch. Ain't no cops stopping me up here. Alice Customs. Customs. Hello, you wouldn't have to be uh, at the shop, would you? We just need a repair. I am not, but I can swing on by. Appreciate that. Thank you. Yep. Be in there in a sec. Why go into the therapist when you have me? As I we can mess in CDs. Typical excuse, saving lives more important than mine. The system is broken. Millions must die. I can meet up now, my office is at 6 of 6. JK, I can handle my problems. I wouldn't be able to handle other people's problems. Nah, usually handling other people's problems are uh, easier than handling your own. Because <laughs> you can just be a hypocrite, which is really fun and easy. Alone at a table for two, and I just want to be served. You the guy that called? Yep. Alright. Yeah, I got my bumper messed up a little bit here. Gotcha. Step into my office. You wouldn't happen to know anyone who's got a, a blue car, would you? A blue car. Sedan, sports car. Enough. 
so I can't help it, but all good. Uh, Alrighty, owe you something? No, because it was zero comps. I just buffed it out. Uh, oh, thank you, sir. Yep. Just a little surface crash. Appreciate it. Yep. Have a nice night. I don't own this place. I just work here. Okay, she said meet up at 606. Her office at 660. That's like down here. Dude, this fucking map is horrible. I hate this fucking thing. Okay. Oh, that place blows. It also says uh, LS Customs, like, on the actual, like, building. So I can't. Gotta double check. Is, is, is they going? I'm just gonna do my right on red. So he is clearly not moving. Still a cop, like, right there. They just saw my license plate, my face, everything. So we're gonna play nice. But Jesus Christ, I hate these fucking street lights. That's definitely an illegal maneuver, but you know, no one cares. Not even the cops would. Oh good. Me you yeah. <laughs> Bum. Mana ma mana ma mana ma mana ma mana ma bum bum Right, sad, sad boy, sad boy hours. Sad boy hours. I can't move when I'm in this many of you. Do I not have a lean radio on this ship? No, I do. I didn't do anything this time. The cops and someone's going three. The street lights in my jump, my country are just like that, dude. I fucking hate it. They're green for so short, yet they take so fucking long. They're only green on one side at a time. Like why? So high, I did not recognize the fire burning in her eyes, the chaos that controlled my mind. Can we go, please? I can't tell if that's a cop or not. Definitely not. That's a cop, though. Damn, they're all over the place tonight. Breaking in front of me, so I have no choice, cause I won't say goodbye anymore. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. I tried my best to feed her appetite Keep her coming every night So I could keep her satisfied oh, Making love 
up like you was just a game. You feel the same. Turn around and leave again. This love has taken its toll on me. She said goodbye. Alright, if you're not gonna go, I'm gonna go. Fucking locals, dude. They piss me off so much. Why do you swerve into the other fucking lane? Watch, let's see if this one does it. Oh my god. How does this work? I guess now you just got that light. This love has taken its toll on me. Uh, I don't know which one is it, so I'm just gonna park. side bring you up okay oh shit I didn't turn my truck off oh well Porter sells cheap gas ah, my thumb oh. hey Hello. how's it going uh, pretty good. Yeah, come on in. All right. Oh my fuck. Welcome, welcome. Oh, nice office. Yeah, you know, small but it does the job. Yeah. Take a seat wherever you're comfy. All right. That's not what I want. <laughs> <laughs> uh. <laughs> there we go. Good hey. enough. Good enough. All right. So how's it going? Oh, you know, could be better. Could be better. What's going on? Well, um. Kind of all started the first day I flew in. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't know anyone, obviously. New to town. And right, let me clock out real quick so I don't get a call. Uh, I made two friends that day. Sadie Joe and Jimmy Jimerson. Mm, okay. And uh, for a while, I kind of like clung to Sadie Joe, kind of like a she's a big sister, I guess. Mm -hmm. And um, well, it's uh, no secret I have a criminal record, and mm -hmm. I did some bad things, uh, and. I hung out with some bad people, but I guess I always kind of had a shell. I didn't really let my guard down. I tried not to open up to people. None of that. Okay. And the one day I decided to let my guard down and just relax. Right in front of my eyes, I watched Sadie Jo get kidnapped, and that was the last time I ever saw her. And I never, ever lived that moment down. And... Yeah, that sounds like a lot. Yeah. In kind of a rage, I dedicated so much time to tracking down her killer. 
I knew who he was, but I didn't like know him. Know who he was. And? And I dedicated, I didn't get much sleep. I barely ate. Um, and in that, eventually, um, he just he got away. I couldn't avenge her death. And that same day, I lost my job. And I got arrested. It was a really, really shitty day. I was at my lowest. I had, I felt like I had no one to go to. And the next day, I actually came out of that pit. And I got a girlfriend. Oh. Hello? Just gonna switch seats here. I'll just stay here. Bro took schizophrenia meds. Um, roam around the house. Bro, this is my therapist. I'm not trying to lose my therapist. She's the only therapist in town. Hello? I hear footsteps. Uh, hello? Uh, if you're here, text me, I guess. Bye bye.
I think she's in there, but I can't see her. Uh, if you're here, can you meet me outside and see if that fixes it? This is so weird. I think she left. I think she crashed or something. I think she crashed or her interior fucked up. Didn't want to hear you. Oh. Sorry. I had popped. Okay, yeah, you're good. Last thing I heard was that you dedicated your time to looking for the killer. Yeah, okay. Let me sit back down. Oh. Okay. So I dedicated a lot of time to searching for him. Like, mm -hmm. I barely slept, I barely ate, and uh, in that time, I tried to keep up social appearances, and I met, I made a new friend at the VU, mm -hmm. and we'll come back to that later. Um, okay. But... He eventually the killer he got away he just disappeared and it's very unlikely I'll ever see him again and so after that same day I lost my job I went to jail as at my lowest and the next day, I um, met back up with that person, that friend I made, and we started kind of dating, and it really helped, actually, like, a lot. Um, she started flirting with me, and at first, I didn't know, I wasn't really... You know, I was kind of too preoccupied to kind of even consider anything. But... I was going through a lot. Yeah. Um, eventually, I... I was hanging out with her, and I started feeling the same way. Mm -hmm. And... Yeah, we went on a date. We were both having a great time. It was really helping. And yesterday, um, she wanted to talk. She said, we're going through this really fast. And I kind of let her in on what I was going through, mm -hmm. which I immediately regretted because then she wanted to drop the entire subject we were going over. <laughs> Um, and she was like, yeah, yeah, it's fine. We can keep dating. And I could immediately tell she just wanted to stay with me because she felt bad for me or like she didn't want to hurt me. Is that, did she say anything to actually give that implication or is that just the vibe that you were feeling? Well, I kept talking to her and just the entire day she just sounded completely different than how she was sounding like the day before. Just a whole different tone. Everything. So and how much did you share with her? Pretty much just Sadie Joe's death. 
Okay. And um, so uh, I kept kind of like prying her because I didn't want to be a part of a relationship that like she's only in because she feels bad for me. Mm -hmm. And I got her to admit that she stayed with me because she felt bad for me. Mm -hmm. And uh, she flew out later that night and I broke up with her over text. I told her I'd be cool with being friends because that's kind of what she mm -hmm. wanted, but like I need time to get over it. And uh, just today, I found out, well, there's a dead person on Birdie who looks a lot like my other friend, so I have that mm -hmm. to worry about. So that's where I'm at. Right. So you have a lot going on. That's fair to say, hey? Yeah. Okay. Um, did you find the person that hurt Sadie? I know who it was. Is that something that you are struggling with? I don't know. know. Who it was? I know who it was, and I couldn't do anything about it. I couldn't adventure. I couldn't do anything. I just why, felt helpless. Why couldn't you do anything? I think he knew I was looking for him. I He mm. immediately just stopped being publicly anywhere. Gotcha. He kind of fell off the face of the earth for you? Yeah. Then he came back. Gotcha did some crazy shit and left town. And so I don't think I will ever see him again or get that satisfaction. Okay. So that is sort of something that you weren't able to get closure on. Yeah. Okay. And then it sounds like there's all these other things that are kind of stacking on top of that. Yeah. That you're also not really getting closure on, hey? Yeah. I mean, okay. I gave up crime completely for her. I mm. got another job to kind of balance things out because mechanic work can either be really profitable or really dead. Mm -hmm. Like... I changed so much for her and mm -hmm. it's like I gave her, I did everything she wanted from me and then it was met with disinterest. Out of curiosity, did she ask you to do those things? She said, stay out of trouble. Mm -hmm. uh, I would say, I will try. Mm -hmm. And she would say, there is no trying. There is only do or don't. And so I did. Gotcha. So you made all the changes that she asked? Yeah. Do you know what it was in the end that she just wasn't... Did she share that? Like what wasn't working for her? <sighs> no. She just, the, so, her only statement was, I think we're moving too fast. I could gotcha. look again. Uh, you don't have to. I was just. Yeah. Yeah. It's up to you whether you want to or not. Um, but again, it sounds like one of those things that you, again, didn't really get full closure on. Yeah, Absolutely. What do you feel like you would need to get that closure, at least for 
your relationship with her? <sighs> Honestly, I have no idea. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe, like, an apology? I mean, like, I know your job isn't only to take sides, but, like, I feel like I put in the work, I did everything right, mm -hmm. and it was met with kind of a punishment, I guess. I don't know. Yeah, it sounds like maybe that person wasn't the most understanding of the sacrifices that you were making for that yeah. relationship, you know? Um. I think I can tell you from personal experience, I'm sure you've heard things, but uh, those are big changes that not everybody is capable of making. Yeah. So good on you for even trying. And it sounds like at least for a while there, I'm not going to poke and prod, but it sounds like at least for a bit you were successful. Yeah. And I think maybe it's less about you and it's more about their own insecurities and fears about the relationship right okay because what it sounds like to me is that you wanted to be with this person you made the life changes that she expected of you and asked you to change about yourself. And those weren't very acknowledged. And so you're you're changing your entire life around and you're not really getting acknowledgement that that was probably really hard to do. Right. And on top of that, it sounds like you were ready to commit to something and you were ready to jump headfirst into it, which isn't a bad thing. Just they weren't ready yeah. at that same level. Right, which is no fault on you. You're just going different speeds. Yeah. Right, so first of all, I want to say that as someone who, in my personal life, I have been around somebody who has taken those steps to change their life as well, um, that's not easy. Yeah. And there's a lot of sacrifices that go into that because I know that a life of crime typically comes with a group of friends that you roll around with, you do the same stuff with, you have this camaraderie, you have this way of life that isn't easy to draw. Yeah, pretty much. So kudos to you for even trying for, for anybody, even if it's just for yourself, for even trying. Yeah. I think what's important is you may never get closure from her. She may never give you the answer that you need. So how are we going to get that for yourself? Um, I'm not sure. It's kind of just, I guess I need to forget about it, live my life. And move on. I think forgetting about it would be a disservice to yourself. I don't think forgetting about things helps you actually resolve this for the future. Yeah. I don't disagree with that. I think <laughs> there can be holy shit, she's good. Things that I don't know you very well, so I'm not sure what exactly this would look like for you. Yeah. But I'm sure there is something that you could do for yourself that is 
closure enough that you feel good enough about yourself that you know that this is not a you problem. Right. Okay. Like, are you able to say right now that you are confident that you did everything you could to make that relationship work out? Yes. Okay. What more could you have done if you already have done everything you could? I don't know. It feels like my life is me doing everything I could possibly do and never getting what I'm wanting or like expecting to get from doing it. What are you life wise wanting or expecting? Happiness. Okay. Fulfillment. Friends, family. Um, Are you looking for that happiness through other people? Probably. Okay. So maybe that's the first thing that we work on. Try and find things that aren't to do with other people that make you happy. And that doesn't mean that you have to be alone and isolated. Right. But try even just once a day, notice something that makes you happy that doesn't rely on somebody else to exist. Okay. For me, it's something as small as it doesn't rain much here. So when the rain comes out and it's pouring rain, that makes me happy. And I don't need to rely on anybody else for it to rain and for me to enjoy that moment. Okay. So try and find a little something that isn't reliant on things that you can't control like other people and their feelings. Even help me. Let's go. What you can control is, hey, this thing happens and I'm going to enjoy this thing. Right. Okay. I think once you start feeling secure with yourself or more secure with yourself, then things like this become a little easier. It's always going to hurt. It's always going to suck. But at least then you can say, I did what I could and it's not my fault. It's not within my control and you can let go of it. Right. That makes sense. Yeah. Okay. Okay. This Is was... there anything else that you need to get off your chest? Mm. No, this was very enlightening. Great. Happy to help. Thank you. You're um, welcome. I think that'll be all. Okay. So if can... something else does come up, you can always shoot me a message or you can give me a call and okay. we'll look up at, Yeah, you know, I uh, don't always have time to come down and do a session, but I'm always around to help out if you need it. Gotcha. And yeah. Just keep on trying to do the best for yourself and the friendship and all that follows. Okay. Okay. All right. She's too good to be real. Uh, how much will it be? Will you invoice me? Uh, let me just give you my number and you can send it. Okay. That way, if you need anything, you can also shoot me a message that way or a call. Okay. I'll send you mine. Perfect. All right, we'll say first one's on the house. Okay. All right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. I will probably see you again. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah, let, just let me know. All I'm right, around yeah. basically daily, so. 
If I basically, I mean, literally every day. <laughs> yeah. All right, you have a nice rest of your day. Same way, yeah. See ya. I did not lock my truck. Alright, I know straight where I'm going. Not, I don't need a second to think about it. Oh, oh, my brain, dude. She was really good. Holy shit! What face cam isn't working? What the fuck? I'm gonna stop sign. That's how these work. There we go, dude. Holy shit, she was so fucking good. Oh my god, I was not expecting that. I wasn't sure what to expect, but it definitely was not that. Oh my god. What? There we go. Outsource. God. Damn. Scandinavia. Better than IRL therapists. I don't know what I was expecting, but it sure as hell was not that. I was expecting some, damn, that sucks. Maybe you should, like, tell her how you feel. Actually, what am I doing? Inductor. Bring me the inductor. Give it me. Holy crap! Yeah, I'm sick as hell. No! God damn, I have to fucking head pop. Are you serious? You the amazing Tom. And send her a photo of the view in the maze bank. It's like a suicide joke. The server's really good, but there's one big problem with it. Let's go in the water tomorrow. Hey, hell yeah. And that is that you can't uh, do suicidal roleplay. Oh wait, whoops. Hey, Hold up. Up. Up, got up, up, that bop, bop. I love that glitch. It is totally so cool. Jesus fuck. I saw what you posted in off topic and it was beautiful. Zero out of ten, worst server ever. I kinda get it. But like at the same time, you know, the shit should be like It's a fucking rated R game, you know.
Tell Robert he got changed that to make it more realistic. My ears. It even says serious RP, like, bro. Yeah. I don't know. It's kind of a touchy subject for some people, and I get that, but, like, at the same time, I can, like, take hostages and, like, murder people. And if the role player wants it, that murder can be permanent. It's crazy, too, because Sadie Joe died Travis's seventh day in the city. One full week. It was like, holy shit. Fucking stakes. That was Oscar worthy. I'm in the fucking server discord talking about how fucking good that shit was. I can't honk. Sad. Yeah, roleplay is a really slow burn. You gotta give it like a lot of time. Cause then interesting shit will happen. Fuck yeah! This is the real therapy right here. I shouldn't say that, sir. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking do it. Today will be the day. I'm gonna max out my fucking strength. Oh yeah, no, working out in public blows. I hated going to the gym for that reason. Everyone just fucking stares at you and shit. Eventually you learn to just ignore them. And like, you know, actually put in the work. And it's great. Ow. Someone laugh at me over there? Internet's definitely gonna be the big thing. <laughs> Cause when you lag in the server, it's bad. People can't understand you. Ow.
I guess I should probably do this. This is kind of roleplay. Yeah! I wish I could hold a wheelie without killing myself. Oh, anyways, the Canuck Storm, he's kind of still around. Dude, I haven't seen him in so fucking long. SpongeBob's house. Oh, he don't know. Till it shrinks around his face. Put Marcia need to at least. Okay, I'll put Marcia need to. And we can if love or death. There. They have their spots. Ow. Oh, it'll buff. I'm gonna go back to working out. Ugh. I'm gonna see why at the hospital. So I'm like, I just fucking saw you. the shit about being a badass <laughs> I hate audio messages I hate making them I get it if you're driving but like if you're not just fucking type please I wish I could do this in real life, holy shit. I hate how loud this fucking sound effect is. Toads run around like SpongeBob's. Damn, you're kind of bad. What you want? Annabelle? Oh, maybe not. Sure. Do sport. I know. She thinks we're all sisters from another mister or something, and we barely ever hung out. Okay, I'm going to the hospital so they can get rid of this shitty ass white flashing effect. No, oh, fuck it, I'm biking to the hospital.
bike lane! Yeah, I got a bike lane, you shit-eating fucks. If you live in a city that's fucking big, just take a bike. If there's a bike lane, you can literally beat traffic. Maybe. It depends on the street. Crosswalk, bitch. Arms around eat SpongeBob's house. Oh, he don't know. Yeah! Fun fact, you can actually, um, uh, drive a bike while under the influence of anything. Anything legal to be under the influence of. You can't get a DUI on a bike. late for school. This is how all those movie stars. Kids like late for school and like fucking rock plays and he fucking does like a bunch of sick tricks on like his bike on the way to school. Like watch. Oh, maybe now I was gonna do a grinder. Damn, time really flies. Holy shit, it's been an hour already. It's crazy, you were talking about, like, um... You're like, I'm actually gonna try to, like, stream for over an hour. Or whatever. I was like, you're gonna try to? The first hour flies by. Each end streams that I make. Ugh. Nematodes. Run around, eat Spongebob's house. I'm glad she's not here. 69 minutes. Nice. Average man, how do you spell quinceanera? I don't know how to spell quinceanera. Yeah, that. Sorry, hold on. Keen? Quinceanera. And yay. Yeah, I know what it means. I just don't know how to spell it. I'm better at speaking Spanish than writing it out. Help! Door! Door stuck!
Dame to fruit Vamos mi amor. It's from a Ramstein song. shooting at each other Hey, quiero puta. You want, bitch? Or, I want, bitch? Because it's Tay? I mean, I do want a bitch, but like, you know. Wop, 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 wop. The light was green in the direction I was going. Cops would pull me over like, Did you steal that bike? I'm like, dude. Who the fuck would steal a bike? Sometimes you have to with the boosting tablet, but you know. Look, I'm going that way anyways. I think I'm actually supposed to use the sidewalk. I think it depends on the state. Some states, cyclists use sidewalks. Some can use the streets. <gasps> Walk. Walk. Lol. My cars are back on lands, but nobody really uses them. I just got hit by a biker while I was walking. Damn. What are porters around? Porter! Are you at your gas station for some reason? Forwarded to an automatic voice message Order. system. Four, eight, zero, six, four, Order. one, two, seven, one, Order. four is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you have finished recording, you may hang up. Order. Order. I'm at your gas station looking for you. Are you in the car wash? Nope. Are you in the store? Nope. What about the back room? Don't be a loser. Play lottery scratch cards.
I hope he plays that voicemail back. I think what's going to happen is we're going to switch, sorry, we're going to max out our strength, then we're going to switch away from Travis for a bit, and we're either going to have, send out Axel, so he can stalk Betty, ooh, Average Baron, you actually might recognize who Axel's based off of. Then take a bike, bitch. Oh, he don't know. Till it shrinks around his face. That shit has burned. It's my breakfast. Everyone just jealous of my swag. Like, watch this grind trick. Up, oh, almost. Grind. See, that was awesome. That hurt. It's from a game. I have bandages. Wait, I should get the song. Or maybe like a different song. And I was man, can you link me to some German death metal marching music or something? Actually, never mind. Scorch. Scorch existed in City for like a very little bit. And then I deleted him because I didn't like him. There was nothing he could do. It's like a song. Good like workout song. Fuck it. This is close enough. Meow. Oh. <sighs> Fuck. Play, you stupid bitch. Please? That's not the song. Burning Heart. I don't know what that song is. Fine. Fuck this thing. Pumping iron to get over to you. 
Hmm, I think I have a cool song. Jam it to me. I'll play it. As long as it's not like... There's no slurs in it. Sabaton for whom the bell tolls. Bell. Three L's. Good job. It might be a little too loud. Okay, I gotta turn it down. Where's the lyrics? Is this an instrumental? Watching telenovela while watching the stream. Sick. The lyrics is coming. Okay. It's been since I've listened to it. The song. No way this is worth it.
It's a penis. I got turned down. <laughs> okay, it didn't decrease in volume like at all. Why? It is. It. So. Loud. Yeah, I've listened to a couple of their songs. Not very many, but you know. I have. Okay, hold on. That was definitely not the answer. I just made everything else really quiet. If I do like sla slash. Nope. Oh. Nope. Damn. Who let the dogs out? Who, 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 who let the dogs out? Hello? Oh, hey. I'll just say. Even flow. Are you all in Prosperity Street Promenade? You're right. I do miss Liberty City. Thinking about all that crime, pollution, and rude people really makes me wish I was home. Yes, Mom, I'm being sarcastic. I'll meet a nice girl soon, I promise. Love you. How am I not fucking Max yet? Which song is this? Swedish Pagans. I'm Swedish. <laughs> hey there, I'm hoping it's gonna be a nice weekend. I'm hitting the beach. Well, I can just bump, bump. There we go.
please, 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 please work. Hey, what well, I was gonna do? Scared me to death. <laughs> I'm gonna do pull ups. Hey, ain't seen you down at the gym for a while. Nope, I gotta do pull ups now. What a retard. Oh. Okay. How sad you are. I was a pro WB after college. God damn it. Damn bald guy. I missed that fucking punch, dude. If I didn't miss that, we were good. 911. Hey, so EMS. I think I went there? I hope EMS has been notified. Okay, the helmet's back on, that's what matters. Someone's coming. At the gym at the beach. I don't know if you noticed, I can't really get on my bike and play the music right now. Just fucking ignoring me. Hey, what's up? You remember that guy from Liberty City last night? What's up, dude? I'm dead. I believe him. I've seen Liberty City traffic and I've seen Los Santos traffic. Los Santos traffic here actually really isn't that bad. It's like a couple cars. Play it in your browser. Uh, I will, maybe, on the walk back. Right back. I could really use an ambulance. Oh my god, there's no EMS on. There's no EMS on? Uh. 
I gotta relaunch 5M. my ears i hate that song so fucking much like why apparently there's no ems on it's 8 30 p.m no ems are on at all usually there's like at least one Yay, I'm perfectly fine. Help. Hey, We're still running tomorrow, right? Help. God damn it. Switch character. Hey. Okay, we have a saving grace. We do. We just gotta... We gotta roleplay it out. <laughs> we gotta call the cops. Instead. I fucking hate that song so much!
bug. Even blow. Run around, eat SpongeBob's house. Step away from that. Okay, slash nine one one and a guy just got the shit beat hey out of him at the gym on the beach. Help is on the way! Good news, I'm pregnant again. Hey, what happened to that beer you owe me? You Congratulations. I choose Buzz Lightyear. What? That's not a choice. Just call me when you're ready. <laughs> I hope Kaden comes get me. That'd be so fucking funny. Am I sending a helicopter to pick me up? What the fuck? Well, ain't it just a small world? God, everyone out here is so annoying. Someone's coming, right? VPD is like literally a less than a minute drive from here. Hello? Is 
The nice thing is I get another like eight minute timer after this one. Oh, I'm pointing on accident. My bad, Chief. I could really use a vacation. Every time I hear a car. <gasps> Oh, thank God. Oh, my savior. <laughs> Fuck. No, I'm over here. No, over here. No. Hello. At the gym. With the workout equipment. Waiting on health. I thought you were the health. Oh god, I'm not a Just trying to hang on until tomorrow. <sighs> hey, hi. Ones and zeros, man. I'm gonna fucking die. Holy shit. Hey, what's up? This is it. I'm sorry. No, it is nice to hear from you. Oh. It's me and my man fight. Looking sexy, honey. Flat packed. Holy shit. <laughs> Keep your eyes on roofs and shit too. Oh, oh, yeah, one of the... 
I don't know. He, I mean, he obviously went down some way. He's got cuts and stuff, too, so, like, maybe somebody stabbed him. I don't know. There, yeah. What? He went down for a reason. Hey, sir. How you doing, honey? I have stab wounds? Put them in my vehicle, the real question. The men all uh, yeah. crowded around the... No, no autographs, honey. Sergeant, right? I'm gonna fucking don't like ugly. die. Okay. Yeah, I think you put him in my vehicle. To stuff a midget with coke and treat him like a pinata. Yeah, it did. Okay. Oh, <laughs> Unlock your car, please. Stupid fucking door. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> All right, uh, meet me at pillbox. Thank God. I might make it after all. Buckle up. Buttercup. We got him, we're going to pillbox. I have a stab wound? What the fuck? I've got him in route, and uh, we're at pillbox. Someone killed him, I don't get it. <laughs> yeah, me neither. I guess, I was going to say, I guess we'll get a statement from him, but he won't remember, so. There you go, buddy. Check Is he in. flat on his back? Yes. Okay. I wasn't for a while. <laughs> oh, that took so fucking long, dude. Jesus, fuck. Watching me sleep. You know, nothing too serious. That was a fucking close call. Holy shit. Oh, what the fuck? What the shit? Uh... Not again! Yeah. What did I do this time? Yeah, you're not in trouble. We were trying oh. to figure out what happened to you. You happen to have a body cam, sir? Uh, I do. Live eyes? I mean, on your body. Do you have no. one on your body? Okay, then we can't use it. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, I have no idea what happened. I was just working out, I think. My muscles feel bigger. Work out with a helmet good. on? Of course. Never take it off. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Sick. Don't have a description or anything. Nothing like that. He doesn't remember nothing. Uh, happens to the best of them. Smith, are you a detective? 
I am indeed. Oh, I didn't know you were with us. Oh. Hello. Hello. Oh. Is that Gotti? No, it's A bulb guy punched me and kicked me. No, I can't remember that. I kind of know what's going on, and I really want them to get back to their scene. I, the player, know what's going on. Travis has no idea. Bruh. Gotta find trash can. Trash can. Hey, I took out a lot of locals. <laughs> With just my fist. I didn't even use the fucking crowbar in my back. Wait, did they take my... Oh, I left my crowbar in my truck! Oh, I had no weapons. Give my shit, boy! Don't pass me, you piece of shit! Don't do it. Don't you fucking do it. Get out. Out. Leave. Ha! Huh. I guess... Let's go back and work out more. I have no enemies. I don't know what could have happened to me. But the fact of the matter is, I have no enemies. Time flied, yeah, real.
Oh. What is connected? Is my mic sound shitty again? Sounds better with you. Oh, yeah, what's the man? Just a while. Just a while. Certain kiss in the morning. A tender case of the evening. Bum 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 I feel right music sounds better with you oh, that's my back whoops wasn't me Time flied, it also lied. Just one hit got me high as shit. Really? Come on, dude. I'll pay you back next week. That you look so better with right, you. Help is on the way. I can finally do fucking pull ups. Only one? Oh, that is sometimes two. I'm going back to doing push ups. Thank you. 
the honk because we were down in that place. That is not a cross look, ma'am. How loud that fucking sound is, dude. I'm convinced the max doesn't exist. Like, there's no way it does. Well, I'm gonna back. I'm gonna give Rowdy some food, I guess. He's pouting about it. I have returned. I know a super chill place on Haywick Ave. Greetings. Ah. Uh. Hello there. Police. What's up? Help me, someone. Whatever, dude. Jesus Christ. Police, help me, someone. <laughs> it's not that serious. The dude on a fucking bike. You are just sheep. I am just a beast. My doctor called, he said I was morbidly a beast. Na, 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 
So, wait, where's my Sultan RS? This is Garage B, okay. Ooh! Yeah, I'll go train myself today. Nice car! The police around here kind of died down. That noise. Mean? That sounds like it would hurt like my throat if I did that. <laughs> Immune to it? I don't fucking know. Dude, it evolved. <laughs> it's like, yeah, it's like, <laughs> dude, just like snort. Ah, uh, dude, I'm gonna fucking grow up. Nah. <laughs> Can't snort? I'm gonna fucking drown. Sam's running here, but actually he's jogging, but... What? Go get Look, him! He looks he's all tired. <laughs> Where is he? Jimmy? Jimmy leaves him and says, go get him. I thought you ran away. Fuck you, Jimmy. I'm sorry. You know how long of a run that is? How fat I am? I, I do it all the time. <laughs> yeah, you're old and in shape. I'm young and out of shape. Your fault. Not my fault. I don't have good jeans. There's literally a gym right down the street. You're too lazy for that. Fuck that. Who's this guy? Travis. That's Travis. Oh shit. I think I have your phone I number. Tell what the helmet on. Yeah, you do. <laughs> oh yeah, huh? What happened to your buddy Donald? Why is he being a little bitch? With, you know, red. Can someone take that. I don't know. Whoever wants it. Carter. He just did a little bit. Touch it, I can kill you. Yeah, I don't, I don't want that. Fucking. 
I don't want Straight it. Straight one gram of burger. How the fuck do you even do that? <laughs> nibbling on it. Nibbling ain't the word for it. <laughs> I mean, Bro, I was taking rat bites. How else bite. you, you get a burger that small? You seen that, uh, that SpongeBob episode with Squidward biting a Krabby Patty? Yes. That's what yeah. I did to it. <laughs> yeah, I'm full. Someone can have that. Yeah, I'm okay. I'll pass. God damn it, I didn't mean to pull the burger out. Fuck, now I gotta eat it. Oh, and you wonder why you're out of shape? Huh? And do you wonder why you're out of shape? You pull a burger out and you just have to eat it? Yep. Can't let it so get away, was, man. Uh, was that you on the expressway? I forgot. Damn, you ate that <laughs> burger fast. That was a whole ass burger. You ate that in like three seconds. I told you I'm fat. <laughs> <laughs> Jack, you missed it. They had this man blocked in. You know, we're just like, nah, it wasn't him. I don't think it was Chill though. Time. I think it was. I think it was dude fucking oh. that was her test driving. I can't move. What the fuck? Lay down. Uh. I got you. Is your huts? <laughs> oh the <laughs> fuck you <laughs> don't. <laughs> move. <laughs> well, like uh, I mean, it could have been him, but the time frame was still off, no matter what. No, it was the other guy. He said he had three cops chasing him. Yeah, it was Sam, the other guy. I, I thought they were point. talking about me. I'm like, I don't think I was even on the highway, and I wasn't paying attention if cops were behind me. Why are they just doing 360s? Fucking stay still. I'm gonna go and find they trash. Block us in, Jimmy. Yeah. You fucking sketched me out. I sketched you out. Yeah, you're like, oh, you were running from them on the highway or some shit like That's that. That's what they you told me. To me. And then, so I thought they were talking about me. I'm like, yeah, fuck yeah, I was flying around at like 200. That's what they told me, because when you read your license, verified your license plate, they brought your license plate and said it was your license plate. Was it a different day, though? Because that could be valid. No, it, they meant, they meant fucking Sam. I didn't. Did that be in your head? No. Is that in the right now, Dodo Shop? That Mercedes? Yeah. No, that's from, like, one of the first ones. Oh, then I probably have it. Okay, Jimmy. We get it. We get it, you're rich. <laughs> Can't hide money. I sure can. I do it all the time. I got You're 900K. so rich, give me 500,000 right now. Yeah. I got 900- I got 900k hidden in fucking tuner shop. Oh yeah, I found that. Oh, it's in a bank account. Just because you're hitting your mouth. Stand by for me. You know how much louder it is for you than us, right? Is it really? Yeah. Yeah, you're good. Uh, never mind, I'm at the hot wire. Fuck that. Yeah, it's so much louder. Hmm. Mickey. Hey, Chimbo, right? Yeah, you, every time you get off, it just turns off. Yeah, I put the key in the fucking ignition. I'm gonna make wine, which is also making money.
I don't like being unarmed. Almost this, almost that. Um, it was green. Hey, it's raining. I love the rain. And let's do it like they do on the Discovery Channel. Oh, my truck. Fuck, it's over there. Well, we have my crowbar. Uh, I'm gonna pull up my Sanctus, which isn't here. God's BMW. <sighs> Pull on my fucking crotch rocket. God's BMW, bitch ass. Dude, I fucking hate the valet. What it takes to get you on the line. Ooh. You don't sound very good. Let's get you fixed up, why don't we?
sex takes me to paradise. Yeah, your sex takes me to paradise. Couple of times. Agreed. Where to go, what to do. Having fun? Let's go on, you join.
Yeah, what's up? Just looking at the bike. Yeah. Uh, no, I was not a part of Yellow Gang. Um, uh, just, just thinking we all got the same bike, but they all look completely different. Yeah. The idea is that when I uh, zoom past someone, the yellow seating will kind of like lightning bolt, I guess. I don't know, it's kind of lame, but you know, it's a funny idea. I I fuck with uh, primary color. Yeah, the dark Bronze. yellow. Bronze. Yeah. This is the first vehicle I ever owned. Probably one of the best, too. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah, he bought that from somebody at Auto Exotic. I remember who didn't like it. Uh, it was Ragnar. How do you not like that? Because you can slide off it quite a bit if you're not careful. <laughs> Just gotta be smart about how you, uh, turn. <sighs> the Canuck is not here. Canuck is... He has really strong uh... Ginger hair. Where is everyone? How is there no fire and rescue? Yeah, you're telling me. Fucking locals knocked me down while I was working out at the gym. Take care, average man. So bright, oh my god.
Where is I? I'm going to be right back. I have to use the record. I wonder if Donnie's around. You're calling. Nope. All right. Gonna be right back then.
Actually, I should go. Um, I'll probably do a part two of the stream and finish it then.